Hello everyone. I'd like to present a video of a 1955 Chevrolet Bel Air convertible in its original colors Regal Turquoise Indian Ivory. This exact car had a full rotisserie restoration which took about five years to finish from start into what you see in front of you. Now the car has just about 700 miles, very careful miles, put on the car since it was fully restored. Never driven in any rain or anything like that. Unfortunately we had to take the video. We just got a little bit of snow a couple days ago, but it went away and uh, we're supposed to get a little more bad weather so this is the only opportunity we really had to take the video. So. It usually doesn't see any type of weather like this. It's always tucked away in the garage, covered up. <clears throat> now again, this is a nut and bolt frame off restoration. Nice thing about this car, it, it is all original sheet metal with only exception of both quarters. And the quarters that were put on the car were original GM full quarters. So, this car retains all of its GM sheet metal. Floors are immaculate. I do have uh, pictures during the restoration as well. <clears throat> uh, this spent some time down south, a lot of its life, and out in the Midwest. Then it came here to, uh, to Pennsylvania, that's when it got fully restored. I only have 10 minutes to make this video, so I'm going to try to fit everything in. So, I'm sorry that I'm rushing a couple things, but I'm trying to show everything in the car. I'm going to show it running and starting, and everything that's functional in the car, which is everything. Yes, even the original radio and clock do function. Now, this car has a 265 engine it does have the power pack option so it is a four bow intake and four bow carb and it comes with true dual exhaust as well the transmission of course is a two-speed power glide now we'll start opening up the trunk and the hood I want to show you nice and the door jams and everything else on this car. The way you see the car is the way it was made in 1955. Let's see if you can hear the clock. I'm pretty sure you can pick that up on the camera everything totally redone in this car every single thing was done the paint is immaculate <clears throat> the body lines are very nice uh, no waves or anything rear quarter areas I like to show you in here fully redone even still has its original motor for the power top which was uh, totally rebuilt but it is the original motor and we got side skirts here which the present owner didn't care to put on the car but he does have them for the next owner what you have here is a brand new set of original spark plugs <clears throat> that were never ever used that goes with the car now there is an original um, washer fluid canister that this car originally did come with the owner opted not to put it back on but you can put it back on and it does go with the car <clears throat> also there's the original jack fully reconditioned as well as all five original rims and here I like to show quick your 44 ACs they go with the car as well never used I didn't have the heart to put them in. He just wanted to keep them when the car was taking some shells and stuff like that. Um, this still retains all of its original stainless as well. That was fully reconditioned. The 
door jam areas. <clears throat> Very nice. Now what I want to what we'll do now, <clears throat> open up the hood. We'll show you the hood. Original hubcaps as well. Fully reconditioned. And this car has power drum brakes. And that was an original option in this car. There's the original generator. The original carb was totally taken apart and rebuilt. Original heads, intake, original exhaust manifolds, original block. This is a true, all original numbers matching car. Rear end, transmission, engine compartment. Water pump is also original to the car. <clears throat> all in here, super solid. Horns redone, everything redone on this car. Now we're going to take you in here. <clears throat> I want to show you the nice feature. You see the clock does function. This is the uh, extent of this restoration. Now we just turn on the radio. If anybody knows anything about these radios, they do take a while, a little bit, to warm up. And you'll start hearing it. We've got to find your station now. <laughs> There we go. There we go. The president did release this today. His plan is to spend. The car knows it. But there, you know, what's the list? Sure. I don't know how many AM stations around here, but. As you can see, it fully functions. That was the extent. That was the extent of this restoration. Now what I want you to do, I want to start the car. <clears throat> we'll take you around. nice and quiet the way the car should be it's finished off with the correct mufflers <coughs> pipes everything the underneath of this car is finished off the exact way it's supposed to be with red oxide primer <coughs> with a turquoise paint blended in underneath the floor and you can see that in all the pictures and I try to get under here real quick <coughs> and see if you can actually see that which there you go All the door jams, very, very nice. I'm gonna take you over. I'm gonna show you the gauges, all the courtesy lights function. Heater was totally redone as well. I mean, just a top notch car. Take it back up here quick. Everything closes the way it should. Very, very nice car, <laughs> inside and out. If anyone has any questions about this beautiful 1955 Chevy Bel Air, please feel free to give me a call. 570-875-7109.